Hey guys, John Velasco here with the VR Source. I'm live here at Oculus Connect 3 in San Jose, California, and I just finished checking out this game called Luna for the Oculus Rift, and it's coming soon. Now, in Luna, it's a virtual reality puzzle game. Now, I wouldn't say it's meant for me, it's not my type of game, but I could definitely see this being targeted towards children for kids just because. It's not really a game, I'd say. It's more of an interactive storybook type of experience. You have some colorful visuals, great storytelling, and there's some light puzzles which are pretty simple to figure out. Now, you utilize the new Oculus Touch controls, and the story's kind of odd. And that's, that's, that's part of the reason why I think this is something that kids would like. So basically, you have this bird and set in outer space, and this bird's in space, and your hands in the game are these pinchers. And the first thing you come across is this plant. And you use your pinchers to, I guess, pluck the petals off the, uh, off the flower. And when you do that, it kind of generates this life, whether it be a plant, an animal, a tree, whatever it is. And then from there, you're transported to the constellation, the stars. And you gotta rearrange them using your pinchers to actually finalize and create this life and after all of that you basically make this storybook world based on your imagination so you populate it with the trees that you created with the animals and you could put as many trees as you want and the, there's that VR element of course just because you have that ability to actually see that world be in it and you know be transported to see what you created but like I said, it's not really a game. It's more of a interactive storybook world than anything else. It's not really meant for me, but like I said, it could definitely appeal to kids more than anything. So if you guys want to learn more about Luna, you could check out our website, VR Source, your source for all kinds of reality.